Hey guys, my name is Elle and I'm from I Am Queen Magazine. How are you guys doing today? I'm Great. good. Doing good. Awesome, awesome. Now you got, listen, this show is amazing. Thank I've been you. watching the screeners and you guys have an excellent chemistry together. Emrod, you play Lily Diaz, a beautiful young woman on the journey of self-love. <clears throat> Excuse me. How important is it for women to understand who they are before entering into a relationship? I think it's crucial. It's vital. Sometimes we forget about ourselves. Sometimes we seek love from others. We want others to validate us. We want others to love us. And it's okay to have that. You know, that feeds the ego a little bit. But overall, I think we need to learn that it's okay to be alone on our, by ourselves. And it's okay to understand, you know, to love our, our imperfections because that's what makes us so special. Sometimes we're trying to be perfect and all these kinds of things that at the end of the day isn't true and isn't real to who we are. So um, to me, it's it's vital that we do that. Also, it's easier said than done. But to me, it's like Lily is a reflection of myself and all my girlfriends. You know, we're all struggling with trying to, to, to find love with the uh, the expectations that society puts on us, that our family puts on puts on us. So it's like, what is a hap where is our happiness? Where is the balance that we put to ourselves? So I think Lily is, is going through that journey that I am so excited excited for all these women to relate to because it's the journey that most women go through. That's so true. Now, Rome, you play the guy who is best friends with his father, reads books, doesn't watch TV, avoids parties. Rome, how similar or different are you from your character? Um, I definitely identify with certain aspects of Santiago, for sure. I do like to read. I love wine. He loves wine, too. Um, I think that's the beauty in it for me to try to find those similarities. Um, I, I don't, I don't know if we have the same outlook on love, you know, but yeah, I think, yeah. I mean, I do identify with certain things. Are you like a hopeless romantic room? Is that what you're trying to say? No, um, I'm a workaholic. Oh, <laughs> so, so definitely like, uh, Santiago. Well, he don't work. He didn't work this season. So I don't know if he just, oh, that's true. <laughs> 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 You laid like off. You're making what? things in the background. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. You just assume he's working on something. There's just there's just one shot of like a bunch of like carpentry in the background. <laughs> it's just B-roll of, of somebody that looks like me working on something. <laughs> awesome, awesome. Desmond, you're in a love triangle. Desmond, you started off as the, you know, the goofy friend that eventually turned into a serious prospect. Tell us a little bit about how, that character development. I mean, you kind of hit the nail on the head there. It's 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 navigating that that spectrum of like, what does the goofy guy look like when he finally learns how to have an EQ? You know, like like uh, was it the Tin Man? If he only had a heart, um, yeah, he, he he he's he. It's it's actually it was a weirdly difficult thing to balance as an actor because like strangely, dignity and comedy for me are like two different ends of the spectrum. So like, how do I keep this guy kind of like funny, but also give him a little bit of like power to, to, to show people that he's grown. Um, and I think, I think me navigating that tension should, should be in theory, fun to watch. <laughs> um, yeah, but no, very excited for people to see that journey. Awesome. Now guys, what would be one word that you would tell people, you know, why, why they need to watch with love this season? Sexy. Sexy. <laughs> ah! hey! let's say fantasies get fulfilled certain fantasies get fulfilled awesome Rome would be a word I, I didn't hear you cut out what is that what would one word be that you would use to invite people to watch this season of with love uh uh it's too hard just Rome Flynn. Rome oh, no, Flynn. No, no, not me. That's not the me. word. Not me. Um, <laughs> funny. It's funny, man. It's hilarious. We'll say hilarious. Oh, oh no. Like, I know one word. We get to see a very, very special area from Rome's body. But this, you said one word. I really couldn't put that so in the I would say buttocks. But, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, that's one word. Thank like you so much better? for being a part of this uh, interview. And I pray for much success on everything that you guys do. And I can't wait to see what you guys do next. Bye. Bye. Thank you. See ya.